Watch you guys got another video here for you on how to install and update all of your programs at once. So if you've got a PC and you want to get it set up really quickly and install all of your programs in one fell swoop, then this video is for you. You can also update and also uninstall and do a bunch of other stuff and it makes things very, very quick and easy to do. So how are we going to do this? Well, we're going to be using Chocolatey, which is a package manager for Windows. Modern software automation makes it very easy to install all of your programs in one fell swoop. So let's take a look by clicking on the install now. This takes us to the install now page, which will then explain how we can install it on our system. Now, all of the packages and software are checked on a regular basis to make sure they are safe to use on this platform. And you can see here, we need to do is choose your installation method. We're going to be using PowerShell and it does give you the code here to use to install it via PowerShell. And all I'm going to do here is copy this code here and install it via PowerShell. You can use whatever method you want to install Chocolatey on your system. But basically, we're going to be using the PowerShell for this video. Now, if you've never used PowerShell before, don't worry. This is very simple and easy to do. It's just copy and pasting, which makes it very easy to follow along. So all you need to do here, you can see here this command here. You can just copy this to your clipboard. Just hit the copy and it will copy it to your clipboard. And then you can head over to your PowerShell and open that up. So then you need to go down to the bottom left hand side, right click and go to Windows PowerShell admin. This will open up the user account control. Click yes for this and wait for this to populate. And now we can right click and paste this command in here. Now, once we've done this, we can now install Chocolatey via this method. So all you need to do is push enter on your keyboard and away you go. You've now got in Chocolatey installed on your system. Very simple uh, installation process, as you can see here. So that is the installation process now completed. And all we need to do now is close down PowerShell and reopen it to continue with installing our programs. It's asking us to do that, as you can see here, uh, listed here. So just close off PowerShell and reopen it as administrator again. And then we can go ahead and start installing applications that we want to on this system. Now you can either install them one at a time or you can install them all in one big fell swoop. It's up to you. So let's go back to here. Uh, the website and basically go on here and start searching for some stuff we want to install. So let's have a look at Shell. This is going to be uh, what was called Classic Shell back in the day. It's now called Open Shell. It's still being supported and you can install this and replace the actual uh, start button and menu system there on Windows 10. So all you need to do is copy that and you can see here uh, it's got Choco Install Open Shell. And that's basically all you'd need to do here. Now I can also install loads of other stuff after that if I wanted to, and I'll show you that in a second. But let's just take care of the single uh, method here. Now if I put a dash Y at the end of this, it would do this automatically without having to intervene and say, yes, do install this. Uh, and I'll show you that in a second. So it's installing that for us right now. So let that finish off. That's now finished. And that has now been put onto our Windows 10 system. You can uninstall it via this method. I'll show you that as well later on in the video. So let's close this off, go down to the start box and then just open this up. And there we are. We've just changed our start menu and also our start button. You can change all this and customize it to your own needs, but this gives you another look and you can switch back to the original one if you wish. And you can also uninstall it and uh, you can customize this to how you like it. And this is the Windows 7 feel uh, of the start menu and button. If you do prefer that, you can still use it. It's still being supported and updated, which is a plus. So let's go ahead and take a look at how we can customize this. Right click on the start button and we need to go to the uh, settings box here and we will now be able to replace the start button and we can also change the style and feel of our menu system here. Now there's loads of options available here, as you can see. Now, if you've not seen Classic Shell before, this is based off of Classic Shell, but Classic Shell uh, ceased to update their software anymore. So people took it over and now keep it updated and you can, it's now called Open Shell. So let's go ahead and get some more applications and I'll show you how to install them in one big package here. Uh, so what you need to do is search for all of your programs. Now you can change your preferences here to 
popularity a to z recent or you could just search for singular programs it's entirely up to you so i've got a list of programs uh, here and i'll show you how to do all of these in one fell swoop so after you've chosen all of your programs you can see we've got choco install and it will give you the name say power toys just like this one here now you don't need to keep putting choco install all you need to do is do choco install just like this and then a list of all the programs just as you can see here as i've listed them here then all you need to do is put a dash y at the end what i've got here copy this and then go over to your powershell right click and paste in here and this won't prompt you at all it will go ahead and start installing these all for you without having to say yes to every single one of these and uh, i'll speed this process up so you can basically see it and what it does so we'll just install all of these and they will appear now you might get the odd error if the uh, install has not gone incorrectly and that's okay you can go and have a look and report that on there or find out why it's not installed properly maybe i put the wrong program in but it should all go in correctly and you should now see a list of all the programs that you've got installed on your system as you can see this saves a heap of time now if you're benchmarking or you're doing some sort of uh, installation on loads of machines you don't want to keep replicating the same process over and over you can just copy all this straight onto the machine and then go across and install that all on the other machines very quick and easy to do so let's open up powershell and let's take a look at how we can update all of the programs and how we can also uninstall programs as well and that will then complete the whole sort of task of singular install uh, installing multiple applications and then also uninstalling and updating so first off let's upgrade all of these by doing choco uh, space upgrade all and then dash y and it will go out and update all of those to make sure they're fully updated which i think is pretty cool because it saves you having to do all that all the time so this package manager makes it a lot easier to keep your programs updated so that's basically the up updated and upgraded uh, ways of doing your programs on your system once you've got that done you can also uninstall now if you want to uninstall you can either uninstall via add and remove programs which is built into windows or you can uninstall them via this method by doing choco space uninstall and then also space spotify and then space dash y and this will just uninstall say spotify very simple and easy to do or audacity or whatever program you wanted to uninstall and we're just going to go ahead and uninstall that and show you how it works and that's now uninstalled on the system let me just quickly show you here you can go to control panel and uninstall these as well as i've already mentioned very simple and easy to do the programs are all listed still here and you can still uninstall them via this method if you wish if you don't want to go through the script method but it's very easy to uninstall install upgrade and do all those things with chocolate tea an awesome uh, package manager i do like it and it's an essential bit of kit for me and uh, give it a try it's not going to hurt and i think you'll enjoy it it's a great way of saving time especially when you format your system and you're installing windows from scratch Basically, you can get this set up and have this on Notepad and then just copy and paste all of this into PowerShell and be up and running in literally minutes and be back to where you was before you formatted your system. So a very useful bit of kit and definitely check it out. I'll leave all of the information and links in the video description. Also, if you want to join our Discord server and have a chat about it over there or if you've got problems with your computers or you just want to join the community i'll leave the link in the video description as well other than that i would just want to say a big special thanks to all my youtube members who will join my youtube members group i really do appreciate the support and i shall see you again for another video real soon my name has been brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk thanks again for watching thanks for your continued support bye for now